The presented anaerobic digestion system operates by taking food waste from supermarkets, councils and food manufacturers. This is an example of a large-scale operation. Most food waste arrives in bags or with packaging intact. These elements and other contaminants need to be removed, so the waste is shredded and mixed with water and industrial food waste. This slurry is then pumped into a sealed centrifuge, where the bags, heavier plastics and packaging are filtered, squeezed and removed. The organic liquid is then pumped to a buffering tank, which helps maintain the correct consistency or batch ratio, and is then passed on to three pasteurisation tanks. The liquid is heated to 70 degrees for an hour and passed into the main digester tank. The liquid is agitated by jets from below. The bacteria within the tank now react over time, giving off around 70% methane gas, but also CO2 and other gases. These gases are collected and stored in a pressurised biogas balloon, which is then piped to combined heat and power engines which provide heat and electricity. In a continuous process, digestate is also pumped to a second centrifuge tank, which removes the water content and provides a final solid digestate, which is used as an organic fertiliser. 20% of the energy produced by the plant is used on site. The rest is sold on to the national grid or to local business.